everybody, it's Paige, and today I'm doing another quick thoughts video on cheerleading. Um, if you like these videos, then let me know because I will keep doing them. Today I'm going to talk about, is cheer a sport? And this is a thing that is highly debated on social media, within friend groups, um, and all of that. It's really hard to talk about because obviously I've been a cheerleader, so um, I'm a little bit biased in that way because... I know how hard it is and I know how much work you put into it, but I also understand the other side of it. If you'd like to know my thoughts, then stay tuned. All right, as you know, I have done all-star and high school cheer. I've done high school sideline and competitive as well as regular all-star cheer. Basically, my opinion is that competitive cheerleading, whether it be high school or all-star competitive, is a sport. You can say all you want about how it's not, but for me personally, that is what I believe because we put in just as much work, you know, just as much time, energy. There are girls that are way more ripped than like half of the volleyball players and like softball players that I know that are cheerleaders because you work so hard to make a routine that will appease the judges and um, it's some hard work like tumbling and stunting and dancing and all of that in one routine that's two minutes and 30 seconds that is a lot of work and it takes so much um, of your time and your energy to do people who say that a sport that is judged is not a sport I don't believe that because gymnastics is judged and that's in the Olympics like there's judges that are giving you a 9 or a 10 so that that is a sport just like cheers sport. dance is a sport too like I, hardcore dancers like oh yeah definitely leaders are you know some of the most fit girls I've ever seen I mean that's not ev everybody because obviously in every sport there is a variety of body types um, and people but and people don't realize that like stunting and baskets and all that stuff it actually takes a lot of muscle because you're throwing another human being in the air who normally is around your weight or a little bit less Maybe a little bit more. I mean, I flew a flyer that was heavier than me in high school for competitive cheer, so it really depends. But um, you're throwing a whole nother body in the air, holding it in the air for extended periods of time, as well as tumbling, throwing your body through the air. And I mean, dancing is always a good workout too. So I believe that there's enough physical activity and enough just in general to consider it a sport. Now, high school sideline cheer where you're just, you know, on the sidelines, cheering for your team, um, maybe doing a little bit of stunting. I don't see that as much um, as a sport just because what you're doing is mostly leading a crowd and keeping energy high and all that stuff. And if you think that it is a sport, then that's your opinion and I'm really glad that you think that. But just personally from my experience of doing high school cheer and sideline, it's just something that I didn't see as intense as all-star or high school competitive. For me doing both, you know, it just really wasn't as hard for me, it wasn't as much hard work, and um, I could have a lot more fun. I mean, I had fun in all-star, I promise, but um, like you can just do a lot more goofing around and just like chilling with sideline, and it's a lot more of actual cheering, like chanting and stuff, which to me, you know, is just less of a sport, but again, if you think that it is a sport, then that is what you think and I'm not going to tell you that it's wrong, I'm just talking about my quick thoughts, that's what this video is about. Yeah, those are just my quick opinions on why I think um, all-star and high school competitive cheer is a sport and why I think sideline isn't. If you have any opinions you'd like to share with me below, definitely, you know, put those in the comments. If you liked this video, make sure to thumbs it up as well as subscribe, it really helps me out a lot and I would love it if you would subscribe because it just makes me so happy and then we can be friends. I think that is all for this quick thoughts on cheerleading as a sport. Um, I hope you found some interest in it and enjoyed it, and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!